Alright, welcome back to Momodora, Reverie Under the Moonlight. We finished the game and we finished the pacifist. Now, uh, what was it? Pacifist plus... What was the other thing I did? Oh boy. I already forgot. I mean, easy mode, but wasn't there something else? Uh, deathless, right, just without dying. So, now I only have... Uh, one achievement left, and that's the insane difficulty one. And to get the insane difficulty one, we first have to play through on hard mode. So, uh, not sure how that's gonna go. So I'm just gonna kind of give this a test run, I suppose. We'll just, like, play hard mode, see if it's completely ridiculous. I'm kind of mostly worried about the, uh, the bosses, because pretty much everything else we can just skip. But if the bosses end up being, like, oh, they two-shot you or one-shot you and... You know, they're super spongy. Maybe this is not going to be super, super fun, but we'll see. At least I can die and stuff. That doesn't matter. So uh, let's give it a shot and see how bad it gets. I also had to, like, redo all my bindings. I finally got a new controller, so hopefully no more random disconnects now. But it didn't register as, like, the same, uh, same layouts. So I had to, like, redo all of that. But yeah, should be good, hopefully. I feel like this new controller, it's like a Series X one. I feel like it's clickier than the previous one. So, uh, yeah, we'll see if that ends up being an issue. Yeah, I could even try using, like, the D-pad. Though that's very clicky on this Series X one. Well, they, they don't take too much damage to kill. Maybe that guy is a little tankier than normal? Yeah, not really sure. Nope. Because, yeah, I guess I'll try and kind of go mostly fast. Like, I'm not going to worry about collecting every single thing. Might not even... I think it probably... Hmm. Is it actually better to go for the non-true ending? Because, I mean, sure, the Golden Leaf gives you a lot of damage, but... At the same time, it means you have to play an entire new phase, which is the harder phase, right? Like, I don't really remember it. I don't know. I mean, maybe we should try it without the Golden Leaf and just see how that feels. And then, like, if that's not reasonable, maybe try it with the Golden Leaf afterwards. Ow. Okay, yeah, so two shots, you're dead, pretty much. And, oh. I see, you also have way less health, and the healing is dramatically reduced. Okay. Alright. So that's how it goes. Hmm. That's kind of annoying, honestly. I don't really like that, that it's just like... Oh, now you have to heal like six times in a row in order to actually heal yourself. But, I don't know. Again, we will see how this all ends up turning out. Is this more enemies here than normal? Not sure which order is actually easier to do stuff in. Like, getting the cat, or maybe getting the, uh... Where is it that we get the, like, the charge? I mean, the charge is from the, the temple, right? But then, or the monastery, but then... That's kind of pointless without the fast charge of the the bow. So I guess doing the, the su subterranean... What is it called? Subterranean grave? Might actually be a better one to go for. Not sure what's faster here. Bad, this guy is kind of a chump. Does vibrate my controller, though, every single time. What was this again? Astral Charm. Oh yeah, right. Okay. Yeah, we don't have any items or anything like that in hard mode. 
you don't start with anything new. Hold on, one second. Yeah, just confirming you can, like, see stuff. Oh, right, yeah, getting the air dash initially might be nice. It's kind of pointless to collect these, but I guess I will just in case they, uh... Ow! Oh, oh dear. They become relevant. Again, I guess you do get some money for them. I guess I'll not kill that. The spider. Very weird secret there. Like, not killing a random enemy that you can kill. Sure, it speaks, but like, how would you know that? That like, it would end up being something in the future. So yeah, getting the HP increases is probably pretty important this time around. Ah, crap. Should be fine, right? Let's just go through, like, really quickly. Oh man, this poison, though. Does poison do more damage than before? I don't like this. I thought there was a save point, like, right here. Where'd this guy come from? Kinda seems like they sometimes just appear out of nowhere. Man, yeah, this was way farther in than I thought. Should we go back for whatever's down here? I can't remember what it is, if it's something I actually want. Yeah, now there's like no enemies here. Oh crap. Jesus. At least the bomb it's ah, itself doesn't poison you. Yeah, man, that heal is rough. But if that's it, if it's just you take more damage and you have less health, but you still do just as much damage and bosses aren't tankier, that's the kind of difficulty I can kind of get behind. If it's just like, just get better, avoid stuff, don't play like an idiot. When it's just like slog, that's when I think it's uh, it gets a little boring. Now we wait. Yep. Same here, Kaho. Oh boy. No, no, no. I don't like this. This could be bad. Okay, we're fine. Yeah, so far so good in terms of difficulty. Let's see the final, the first boss.
Doesn't seem that tanky. Oh, wrong direction. Oh my god, okay. All right, that seems to be what it's, what it's like. Just don't get hit, lol. Well, I don't hate that. We'll see how ridiculous it gets. And I guess now I actually need to like learn their patterns and stuff. Is it just this pattern over and over? No? Shit, okay, didn't actually die. Let's try and heal up quick. You can also just outspace it. All right, yeah. Yeah, this is pretty good. This is kind of like the difficulty I enjoy, but we'll see. We'll see if it gets insane. Let's go back and save. Having like punishing but fair fights is always fun in these types of games. I'm just gonna ignore everyone, I guess. Don't think it matters. Ow. Ooh, that's a lot of damage. Do I want anything? Secrets, not really. Attack up. I mean, the missive might not be as, like, valuable this time around, because the healing is going to be a lot more valuable as well. So maybe having just the straight up more damage might be better. I think I'll take that. These aren't too bad. You get three of them right. Whoops, wrong. No, only one. Okay, all right, that's a little worse than I thought. But I guess maybe in a pinch. Yeah, I really feel like you're gonna be hearing the, the gamepad a lot more than normal, and it was already kind of loud. I'm like even trying to hold it under my desk so it's not as loud, but man, this one is very clicky. Ooh, Jesus. That's new, isn't it? She wasn't here last time. I don't think. So there's like... Some new enemy spawns and stuff, maybe? Oh god. Oh Jesus, yeah, okay, alright, fair enough. This is certainly not going to be deathless. Crap, really gotta dodge more. I, I tried to dodge there, but I was like locked in an animation. That's kind of unfortunate. How was I locked in animation? I swear I dodged. And it like didn't happen. I guess it's because a hit stun or something? Like if you hit? No? Yeah, there's something about that. Where sometimes if you're like, if you try and dodge right at the hit lag, where you hit an enemy, then you don't get the dodge. So, all right. That's something to keep in mind. That double money drop is kind of nice when it procs. Uh-oh. All right. Yeah, this, this section is kind of rough. I don't want to climb down. I want to, like, try and keep this... Just take it slow. There we go. 
Ah, damn. Thought I could, like, smash him before he smashed me, but no. Part of me even wants to, like, go back at this point, but it's probably not worth it. Crap. Don't think I can take one more hit. Oh boy, yeah. It's pretty rough. Oh crap, okay. You can't stun him with that. Uh oh. I don't remember where we get a save point here. Oh my god, wait, what just happened? Did something telefrag me or something? I don't know what just killed me. Man, this this section is rough. There is like no save point for a very long time. And everything kills you in one or two hits. Yeah, I, I was more worried about the boss fights. Maybe that's not the problem. And this is only hard mode still. There's still insane mode to get to. Ah, oh, man. Dodge one and you just roll into the other. Maybe we should just run? Yeah, screw that screen. Maybe we should go down here. Then I miss out on some gold, but... I can just go back up here? Oh, this is bad. This is, That's really bad, okay? That's a terrible idea. Good lord! Yeah! Not a huge fan of this stuff. When again, it's like... If you make one mistake, you might as well just like... Load the game. In this section. On bosses, that, that's generally fine, but when it's like... Every single enemy attack in the game is... Almost like... What's the word? Like... You can't have it happen. It's not fine to take a single hit. That gets a little much. Because, I mean, I kind of assume that's what it's going to be on insane mode, if this is what it's like now. Come on. So what's happening here now? Did someone just like teleport onto me? Yeah, someone did just teleport onto me. Fun. Where did we go for a save point? Well, this, this works. And we get more healing. Alright. Good. Oh boy. Too bad we only get more healing, not like, better healing. But I guess you get some of those, uh, like, the special ones. Can't remember what they were called, but like, the one that's a full heal and stuff. But wasn't that like a lengthy spell cast that's kind of pointless? I assume I don't want to get hit by this guy, but do I even need to do anything? Like, how does this guy work? Do I need to do any damage to him? 
Oh god, that's... I mean, I, it's not new, but don't remember that. I don't know if you have to, like, get him to half health or if it's just survive for a certain time. Looks like get him to a certain health threshold. Oh, God. Rumbling. Yeah, there we go. Oh, is that new? I don't remember seeing that attack from the bottom. Well, she doesn't seem too bad. Yeah, that's not bad. Oh, right. You can just walk. Oh my god. Screw you. Oh, this is bad. I don't remember if I need to talk to her. I don't think so. So, where do we want to go? This is just the uh, magnet charm, right? Oh god. Oh, not you two. Alright. Let's put that on. Why not? Oh, I wanted to go and heal and save again. Not sure that's even a good idea. Alright, so where do we go? Do you want to go down to begin with? I don't know what's the better place to go. I mean, I don't know if we can do the subterranean thing. I thought you needed the air dash for that, but maybe you don't. And if so, then that would be... Is that, like, unavoidable? What the hell? I, I don't know. I guess I have to just hold off and roll it instead of, like, trying to rush her down. She just has, like, perfect tracking every single time. Wait, I don't remember if you do need the air dash or, or not, so let's check here. If we can get to Frida and all of that. Because that is probably... Like, after the air dash is probably the most useful upgrade. You can't skip cutscenes. Just a second while this is going on. Hey, there we go.
I wonder if Skeleton Man Sans is just gonna be in the the cell, even though I didn't talk to him. Oh yeah, there's two cat maids there. Okay, so there's definitely updated enemy spawns. Clarity shard. I don't really want any of this. I mean, I guess necklace of sacrifice. Like, we might be on uh, low health a lot, but yeah. Oh boy. Yeah, he's not here. Huh. Okay. Interesting. So if you don't talk to them, you don't advance the NPC storylines or whatever. wonder if any uh, terrain has been modified. Like harder jumping puzzles and stuff like that. Oh my god. Can't say I'm surprised they one-shot you. Hmm. Okay, that's better. I mean, in that case, I guess I don't even need to go to the right. Do I even care about what this is? Isn't this just money? I think that's just money. Let's just ignore it for now. And then we can go left and right, but right was nothing, right? Right was just like where we need to use the garden key. <sighs> yeah, saw that coming. As soon as I swung, I knew it was too late. God damn it. I mean, that wasn't even like hard mode's fault. Nice. Okay, you can just hit that through the wall. Good. New save point. Uh, where do we go from here? I think that's the way forward to the place where I thought you needed the dash, but we'll see about that. Yeah, what is this again? Is there like a secret here? No? Oh, that's the garden key, I see. So how do we deal with this guy? Or these guys? I guess just stun them? Yeah. Just gotta make sure to melee and stun them. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, yep, that probably would one-shot you too or something. Gotta be really careful.
So here I thought you needed air dash. But you don't. Okay. This is gonna be tricky. Oh boy. Alright, good. Got the shortcut. Yeah, I mean, it sure is tense. But again, I'm worried since... Ooh, nice. Didn't even know you could do that. Since this is still just hard mode, we still have insane mode, which is going to be even, even more than this, and I don't know how much more. Oh, okay, that still hurts. Kind of bad to not have full HP for this, but mm, I guess it's fine. Need the practice anyway. Damn, cancel my... My bow shot. Whoa, how do you tell that she's going to do that? I couldn't see any tell. Oh, just rolled into that. Okay, so that's the tell, the like bubble thing. I thought that was me hitting her doing that. I thought she didn't do damage on contact. Huh. Alright, well, she doesn't seem too bad. This seems like it'll be fine. Oh, that just disappeared? Weird. Yeah, that's weird. It... Was there a tell? I don't know if there's a tell for that. Was there the, uh, the bubble thing? Because I'm not seeing it at all. It's, like, really hard to notice. I feel like there should be some other, like, tell in her model when that's going on. Yeah, sometimes they just don't drop that. I guess if it's, like, in a wall or something? I don't know if I should save the power-up, but I mean, I don't think it matters. Okay, there we go. I saw it. Still hard to avoid, though. And I'm, like, seeing it and thinking it's just, uh... Oh, no second dog? I guess I can just crouch it as well. I'm thinking it's just my charge instead. Ah, oh, crap. All right. Okay. Yeah, I think I'm getting this down. Just kind of want to run past all this, but that might not happen. Does it matter if I leave her? Is she going to, like, attack during the fight? I hope not. Oh my god, she is. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. Nope, don't do that. 
That is not happening. Whoops. Again, I I wish that tell wasn't the same as you charging your bow. That effect is the same effect as when she charges her laser. So it becomes really hard to like tell if she's doing the laser or if I just got my charge. Would be nice if it had like some other energy building animation for her or something, just for clarity. Because otherwise this feels like a very fair boss. Just that one thing. Is kind of annoying. I don't really understand that. I guess it's just when she's walking. I I tried to roll. I swear I tried to roll and instead I just attacked one more time. That was weird. I don't know what happened there. There was some, like, input buffering or something? I don't even know if there is. Yeah, I, I think I did it there too. Like, after this, I can't roll for a very long time. Yeah, so there's something... Something preventing you from rolling sometimes, and it seems a little inconsistent. Which also is annoying. Yeah, like right there, I actually couldn't dodge because I was during, I was in the middle of my second, my, my third hit. So maybe I shouldn't even do that. Maybe I should just stick to two hits. Or just do jump hits instead. Okay, jump hits are not the answer either. Oh crap, just dodged into that. Yeah, I think just doing two hits, not more, so you maintain your ability to dodge at any time. Yeah. Because doing the third hit is like such a commitment and you can't dodge while you're hitting. That's actually kind of annoying, but I guess like some techie stuff, like it does do more damage. So I suppose you have to choose. Do you want to commit to the damage or do you want to dodge? So there's some like skill cap in that sense. Yeah, now we have fast charge. That's good. Uh, oh. What was that, like, up in the left? 
transport right. Didn't I just see something? Up in the top right of the screen, it looked like something was moving. I don't know what that was. So, yeah, let's go down this. No, no, no. Yeah, down and then left more. We'll go in the garden. I suppose. Should I? Or should I go to the... Whatever it's called? See something? I always forget. I would say cistern, but it's not. It's something else. I suppose we might as well do this, though. Booba Lady might be kind of rough here, honestly. Without, like, more power-ups or whatever. That was a bomb. Yeah, hitting the bombs seems like a good idea. Because for some reason, they don't do damage to you when you hit them. Crap. Do the ble bell flowers, bell flowers heal like based on percentage or something? Because I almost feel like they're healing more the more HP we get. Not sure. Isn't there a save point or something up here? No, this is just where we meet the guy. had like one don't remember if there's a save point nearby here there's this guy yeah man the, the face buttons in particular are just so so loud on the Xbox Series X controller. It's uh, kind of insane. See, so yeah, we can do that. Ah. Uh, I don't even know where to go from here. I mean, I think let's just continue in the garden. I don't think it really matters too much. Like, in terms of difficulty, which area you do at which, which time. I don't really remember any of the areas being dramatically more difficult than the other others. Maybe the... whatever it's called again, see something, is probably the hardest one. Mainly just because there's so many things that do a lot of damage, and now in hard mode, they're probably all gonna one-shot me. Oh, damn it. Kinda wanted to check that, but eh. I guess let's go down. I'll have a drink of water. Think I can do this right? Oh, 
Nope, not without the cat or air, da air dash. That's just that screen. All right. Oops. Anything I want? Dull pearl? Yeah, sure. Oh, that's a thousand. I do kind of want that. I think that would be a good one to have. But I guess we'll see if we can defeat Booba Witch. Oh, crap. Whoa, okay, all right. Well, gotta know about that now. That's a new attack, isn't it? I don't remember that happening. Great. Yep. Okay, that's not too bad at least. This one is really hard to dodge though, like I still don't have this down. Maybe just two rolls in a row? I guess? I don't know if that's completely consistent. Man, it's a lot of stuff. She doesn't have much health though. Okay, good. Crap. Hmm, damn. That wouldn't have, even if I healed, that wouldn't have mattered. Yeah, okay, this is not bad either. I'm, I'm kind of a fan of this type of difficulty. Hmm, crap. Not a good start. At least I get to heal up here during this. Maybe I don't want to roll here, just like, reposition. had to roll there, but like, mm, yeah. I had to roll, but it still took me to a bad position. Not sure if that's better. Yeah, keep laughing. Keep laughing. It's good. Yeah, just just laugh the entire fight. That's great. <laughs> That's just RNG. I just got lucky RNG. So I guess bosses don't follow like a strict pattern. It's just RNG. All right, cat get. Uh, where is it that you always? I always forget like which part is the uh, the bonus path, and which part you have to go through. I guess neither is the bonus path. Hmm, damn. Can't heal either as a cat.
anything I want to do. What's down down here is just the the secret. That's right. Is that showing up on the map? It's just the like secret screen. So I guess I don't care. Damn. I think that one tiny bug took like all of the arrows for him. I don't want to go this way. I feel like that's much harder. Ah, crap. We can get this one now. Hello? Hello? Huh. Was I just... too low, I guess? Alright, let's get this one. I can always farm up money if I want to. Because, yeah, I think having poison is going to be nice. Probably not for normal stuff, but for uh, bosses. Ow. This was just like a health up, right? Nope. Oh, that's, that's worth it. Wait, can I even jump that? I don't feel like I can jump that without cats. Yeah, and then there's nothing going down again. All right. Not sure I'll be able to beat this in, in one sitting, but I mean, so far, so good. So far, it feels like I can do this again. Insane is going to be... The real question? remember where to go here. This is just an extra thing, I believe, right? Ow. Yeah, this is the health up that I was thinking, thinking of. <sighs> Jesus, I tried to dodge. Yeah, that's... A little annoying that, like, you keep getting screwed over by animations, like, you know, it's consistent, it's just don't dodge during those animations, but I, I kind of wish dodging just, like, overwrote any action, no matter where in the action you were at, so you could always feel like you're not being, like, cheated out of a dodge. So, yeah, I, I swear I'm pressing the button, it's just during a time where you're not allowed the dodge. It might even have to do with, like, specifically killing enemies, not necessarily just, like, the part of the hit, or the third hit, but just when you hit and kill an enemy, there's, like, a hit lag thing that just cancels out your inputs. I think that's it. So, yeah, you can see it, like, kind of freeze a little bit. Alright, take the slow. There we go. Now, do I want to go back and heal, or do we want to go down? I don't remember if there's a healing or a save point soon. Remember. 
Ow. Yeah, those small ones are the bad ones. The big ones, no problem. But the small ones just, like, fly into you. Hmm. That's a bit of a problem. Let's be careful. Where is the save point? I, I don't know. There's no save point up above, is there? I think it's down below. Here's the spider. Do we want anything? I wonder if you can kill the spider here. I should test that. Drilling arrows. That's pretty good, actually. I wouldn't mind getting that. Restores HP whenever... That's actually very interesting now that I... Now that I read it, it's a passive. So what if you put on the dull pearl and then this, and then you just like make sure you're always poisoned, then you're gonna be doing extra damage and you'll just keep healing yourself. That might actually be worth using. It's only a hundred, let's try it. But maybe it, it means like passive effect from an active item, I don't know, probably not. But yeah, I guess I do want the drilling arrows, so we might have to farm some money. No, yeah, it's a, it's a passive. Dreadful liquid produced by Tor, the slumbering doctor. Its aroma, although deadly, has charmed many unfortunate souls. So I guess I'll, I'll want dull pearl then. But I mean, normally I think I, I will want to just get money. Here we go. Alright, but I mean, now we have a boss fight, so let's try it out, or almost, soon. Holy crap, I just, I actually wanted to take damage just to see how the poison would work, but guess not. Yeah, what is that poison hitbox? Well, let's try it. What? What do you mean? How did that hit me? I really want to get poisoned now. Nice. Yeah, just maintain the poison. Let her do the tanking. Okay. This actually is kind of insane. I'm almost... I can just, like, face tank things. No, I cannot! <laughs> no, I cannot. I guess some attacks... I mean, maybe if we get more HP, if I get enough HP, maybe I could just, like, tank things. Okay, Jesus, that range. I'm just gonna blow these up. I feel like they're just gonna hurt me. Even though I'm sure you can use them on her as well. Oh 
Okay, careful. Oh boy, careful. Poison me. Damn it. Poison me! I can't get poisoned! Nice. There we go. Yeah, it's a pretty simple fight. Your videos are massive file sizes? Yeah, I mean, they, they kind of are. I mean, it really depends, like, on the, the series, because, yeah, compared, like, Rain World, episodes are, like, you know, let me just check, like, maybe 200 megabytes or something when they're ready and compressed. Two, three hundred. Some are, like, up to a gigabyte, if it's, like, a very uh, intensive episode and stuff. But, yeah, for Talos Principle, Base, like, raw recordings are insanely big, like, 20, 30 gigabytes or so, and even when compressed, most episodes are like 2 to 4 gigabytes, somewhere around there. So yeah, it takes up a lot of space. I have terabytes of recordings, because I, I save everything, though so they are compressed, but that's not, it doesn't really help. Yeah, you just keep having to buy, uh... Storage, basically, like cheap storage if you can. If you actually want to save everything, you could just purge it once it's like up on the internet. Just remove your uh, your files and stuff. Perhaps you'll hear me out. No. You damn roach! I'm not wasting my time with you! Nice. Guess we're not gonna see that other one. There was like one more character that had like a yes or no. Alright, nice. Good progress. Oh god. Twenty to thirty gigs is what you're saying. I mean yeah that's probably a raw recording. Like that's a very high quality recording. You might want to use something like Handbrake. Handbrake is a really good tool for just compressing video files without losing too much quality. If you actually want to like store them long term. I just use my like 20 to 30 gig recordings just for uh, like editing. Once a video is edited, you should probably just get rid of the raw recordings. Yeah, no problem. Good luck with your video stuff. Yeah, I guess there's nothing else to do. Now we just gotta make it up here. I don't think I can go this way, can I? How do you get up here? Oh, this way. Nope. Did I get the key for this? Isn't that later on? I don't think I have the key yet. Oh boy. this for a shop. I mean, that's not bad. That could be useful, but it is... Oh my god, it is just a small amount of HP. Oh, 
that we can't get back from here. I don't think I got the key. Did I? I did. Oh god, okay. Second star. Didn't see that. What was this lever for? I'm not sure what that does. And yeah, I think I'm gonna swap off this whole uh, poison build and get back to money making, because now we need a lot of money. I do want 500 for that spider thing. Oh, I see. That's what the uh, the lever does. Stops these. Isn't there a secret here or something? No. Go this way, I guess. Oh, yeah. Isn't there a, a secret here? There we go. I don't think there's anything down there that I would care about. Oh yeah, money farming screen. I guess I kind of should go back. Do you have anything I want? Berry tier? Not really. But yeah, I do want the 500 and then we need 2,000. And I mean, we're not going to get more money. So I'm wondering if I should just farm up. It's not super slow, but it's not super fast either. There might be better farming spots. Yeah, I don't, I don't think I'm getting 2,500, but let's get a little bit.
Yeah, let's just get to like a thousand or something. And I guess we'll complete this monastery thing. And then I, I'll go back and get that uh, piercing upgrade. Yeah, when does that open? Not sure when the dev room opens up. Ow. Right, that's that. Let's go up here, or I guess we're we're kind of close to the the shop now, so I, I might as well go down at this point. There is something here as well. Guess that's the double money. So I thought it was like they have a chance to drop double the total money. I mean, I guess that might be it. Like when they drop a golden one. The gold one is worth as much as all of the purple or pink. I don't know. So let's get that. Let's see if we can kill him now. Nope. And I don't think you can go back to the, the forest and kill him now. Right, we can't go up here. Wasn't there a, a secret somewhere here? In this screen? I remember it beeping. Like, up there or something? Yeah, what was that beeping about again? Oh yeah, wasn't it over here? Yeah. There we go.
Okay, let's go and check what's in these ones as well, just in case there's something I care about. Nothing here. How do we go? Oh, I just like didn't go slightly more to the right. Well, damn. I gotta go all the way around again. Jesus, okay, that does a lot of damage. Wait, why am I going up here? I shouldn't be going up here. I should be going down the r to the right, yeah. Climb our favorite ladder. There we go. All right, now let's take care of this place. Yeah, I don't know, it's it's not really looking like I'll have time to do everything. Because, like, the final dungeon in particular is very lengthy. Like, after you get all the, the crest pieces, that entire place takes a while, so... I don't know. Maybe I should leave it for two. I do kind of want to, like, get this over with, honestly. Like, try out insane mode, see if I'm even going to bother. Holy shit. Didn't do that much damage, at least. Oh, and that's the missive. Yeah, we'll see if that's actually usable. In this difficulty, don't remember how much it normally deals. Just get out. Let's go back and save. Baby steps. Let's play it safe. Oh, hello. I really hate these guys, because they they just show up out of nowhere, and oftentimes on top of you, and then, yeah, you die in like two hits.
No, this guy is new, I think. I don't remember him being here. Damn. Think I'm doing the secret boss. Not if there's no reason to. Let's try and use a missive. Definitely gotta learn this fight. Don't remember it fully. Oh, and also I should be swapping this stuff. Maybe drilling? Nah. Drilling doesn't really do anything here. Ooh. Get that healing. Yeah, the poison is doing work. Nice, yeah. Okay, I kind of remember the fight, and yeah, it's a pretty good one. Poison build is damn strong. What? What do you mean? These can actually take more than one hit? I've never seen that. I guess they have slightly more HP in hard mode. Yeah, damn. And that was the full charge, was it? Yeah. Which is very strong. I, I wonder if that affects the poison in any way. I don't think so. I think poison is just poison. It's not like based on which hit, damn it, you use to apply it or whatever. Just gonna try and go here. So that's it. We just have the uh, the forest crest. Oh man. Ah, oh, it's it's such an awkward time because it's like, if I push on now, I know it's gonna be longer than I want, like two and a half hours, three hours. I don't know. And I mean, then I don't have time for blasphemous. But if I stop now, then it's a. I mean, I guess it's a pretty good time to stop. Honestly, don't remember what's up here. Oh yeah, it just links up here and. The crest, and I guess the crest was up here. Yeah, it's just some stuff. Maybe we'll go through there. And then we just gotta get back to uh, the start again. Yeah, 60% as well. Like, that's not overall completion, but I think I am gonna leave it off here. So, so far, I'm enjoying hard mode. There's a couple of gripes with, like, the dodging being taken away from you at certain points in the, the attacks and stuff. And... That one tell from Frida is kind of the only attack I didn't really like because it was confusing when I also have the same same effect. Hold on, before I forget. Put this on for next time. We need 2,000 to save up for that fire one. That's definitely worth it. But yeah, I feel relatively confident that I'll be able to do hard mode, but if insane mode is just... things do even more damage, but you still do equal damage and, like... It's just about learning the patterns, and especially the bosses, I feel, like, get them down without taking damage. I'm kind of okay with that, maybe. We'll see, but yeah, some of the uh, enemies might end up being kind of rough, like normal levels in Insane. Only one way to find out. So, thanks for watching. I'll take a bit of a break, and then I'm gonna do some Blasphemous. See you then.